What's up, everybody? My name is Omega Jinji, and welcome back to the continuation of the live stream I was doing on YouTube, which I'm now doing on Twitch because YouTube uh, somehow fucked up, and I don't know why. Where are we? So I, I decided to it. just restart this section here. Hello. Oh, that did not taste good. Visiting Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. Yes. Precisely. The key? Mm hmm? Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> this way, then. Oh. Stay close. Hey, yes, sir. Now, I didn't realize it would take me After all the way back when I decided to restart the checkpoint. Just because I wasn't 100% sure where the YouTube stream you would take me. Inside the cars, if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> How many volts are there? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power or both could have arranged for such a service. You want to take a breath? A what? Waterfall huh. washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It was Damn. in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Vault 12. Oh yeah, now I get now Momentous I see what it meant. <laughs> hmm. On your way. So again, again, if it's rare, then how do you know your stuff's still there? Here we are. When was the last time this All right, so we're basically access? caught up to where the kind of like where the YouTube live stream years. ended because. In that time, no one has visited <laughs> just out of 12. nowhere my late stream just went gone even though 
on PlayStation instead of live streaming. But on YouTube itself, it's like, no, your stream ended. It's like after a half an hour, why? I wanted to live stream this on YouTube because I haven't streamed on I'm YouTube sure. in so long. So, I wonder if you so it's like, well, seeing that to grant access to the holder of the that happened on YouTube, well, I'm not going to be streaming on YouTube Wait. then. I'll keep videos to YouTube, though again, streaming Xbox games, you can't stream to YouTube anyways. So, having to play Let me think. Xbox games, for example, there on YouTube or on Twitch here. only. I might as well just keep the PS5 games as well to Twitch, yes, uh, Twitch as well. Charm. No time like the present. All Let's right. See what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand. All right. Focus. Uh, steady your wand with the left stick. Guide along the symbols. Path to learn the spell. Press the corresponding input when prompt to accelerate the wand's motion, allowing the symbol. Yeah, you gotta keep it moving. Aha. Revelio. Press with the done deep hair. I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. All right. Uh, how's uh How's this close? A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see oh, the I didn't realize. Then I, didn't I dare realize say we the chest over there. Discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Yes, sir. All right, investigate. So cool. Lumos. Wait, what the? F this is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay I don't know. close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. So I would I like, just walk off the path? Revelio. Can I just keep walking? Oh! <laughs> it just pops up to go back. <laughs> That's what happens, okay. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> she could have stayed in the light. Wait, how does she know where Troy to Rebecca, go, though? I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Well, now we know where to go. It's like a fucking well of souls. Ooh, investigate. Lumos. What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have <laughs> caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Reveal. Well, reveal it. I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Okay. Steady one. Okay, so the same thing. All right. Uh, X. X. Wee. And X. Lumos. Well, that was cool. What is this? You acquired the wand lighting charm, Lumos, which uh, has automatically been slotted to your spell slot. 
We must create a light at the tip of your wand to help you see the dark areas. Hold R2 and press trial to cast the wand. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Oh. Potato. Potato. Defendo. Levioso. Deposo. Huh. Huh. I do like shit damage. Ow. Deposo. Exposo. Stupid one. Confringo. Oh, press trial three times. Oh, okay, so I have to actually get attacked. Come on. Oh shit, I did that way too soon. Oh, did that too early. Alright, one more time, one more time. Tap our two. Professor! Oh. Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? Well... What's happening? Oh, the that's... The of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Revelio! Let me just make sure there's... Lumos! Ah, <sighs> oh, that's cool. Oh, there's another chest. I love how I don't actually have to go to it, I just had to... So I'm guessing it's this way. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ah, that's where they're leading me. That glow again. Ooh. Best to get. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Oh. Lumos. Oh, there's two of them. Okay. Oh. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight. I need to align these statues with their reflections. Yeah. Ow. Oh. Stupid. Oh. Stupid. Hold trial during during, uh, during Pissarro's to stun an enemies with stupefy counter attack stun enemies to get damage inflicted indicated by the golden number wait just hold it oh So I have to wait till it does that. So I have to keep an eye out on the indicator. Yeah, become stupid. I admit, I do like the, uh, like, I can, like, move the right stick or I can press, like, R3 to lock onto things. I kind of like the movement one. Lumos. 
Rebellion. Lumos. What do you want? Rebellion. Anything else? Lumos. Ah, oh, sweet. Sprinting. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Lumos. Where's that? This, but what about this? Lumos. Hmm. Oh, funky. Revelio. Oh, chest. Get the chest first. Before we do anything. Where's the other one? There's one over there. Anything else? No? Okay. Got like a weird funky glow around like the border of my screen there. Oh. Youth potion? Uh, there you are. How did you... What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. What that basin? is no mere basin. Oh. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. Follow my lead. Oh, it's how he built it. They built it. All is in place. The port key is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. Huh. They took the memory out. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. 
Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Huh. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. Uh... <laughs> uh, sir, they had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have a... <laughs> you didn't have a key. I have no patience for traitors. Now... Where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Well, this gave me the option to be young evil. Let me backstab my teacher. Oh. Please tell me I'm not having to be the one to fight that. Oh. I know my out. Professor. Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Probably what he's wearing. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. And Come. where is here? We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Oh, that's where we are. There's the train. <laughs> I got fucking goosebumps. Hi, Lawrence! Port Key Game Hogwarts Legacy. Awesome intro, awesome intro. Sorry, girls. Oh, you started clapping my hands, I woke my hands up. I was gonna say that title screen was there for quite a bit. All oh, the load screen is the uh, the schools. Oh, good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now. I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Huh?
<laughs> Phineas Nigellus Black. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. Hi. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig. And I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Yes, sir. Oh, wow. Supposedly a young Harry Potter dude. We've one more to be sorted. Welcome. Well, you're just in time. Have a seat. Cool. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? <laughs> you come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Uh, I can't wait to explore. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm, indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Hmm. You do not give up easily, do you? You are undaunted by challenges. But yeah, by ahead. the Hogwarts like act that they had to do of the house. Delayed your arrival here this evening. I'm now Perhaps uh, you belong in Hufflepuff. Oh, right, because I linked it. Yeah, so I'm in Hufflepuff. Sorting hat will take your ch count, uh, choice into account when you sort it into your house. Hufflepuff house, known for its patience, loyalty. Yeah, I am a Hufflepuff because that's what the fucking app shows. <laughs> Yes, I'm Hufflepuff. Better be Hufflepuff. Because I did the, they had the sort, they allowed you to do like a sorting hat on an app like a couple months ago, and I did it, and I'm a Hufflepuff. That's actually not my choice. I thought I'd be Slytherin. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Oh, so that's Enough. why there's no Quidditch in this game. It's not as though I've game. banned flying altogether, but don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Huh. I said... I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. <laughs> Get out of here! Go! Shoo! Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new students to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. Ah, oh, she's, uh... As I was saying... Ron Weasley's... Weasley. Probably... Grandma? Nice well, Professor. Great grandma, great 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 grandma. Oh. Right this way. I don't know much of the lore behind Harry Potter. I like barely even read the books. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of work, but I'm sure that's never stopped you before. It hasn't, Professor. <laughs> now, here we are at the entrance to the Hufflepuff Common Room. This is the entrance. Indeed. I will explain what to do, but I hesitate to do it myself, as one errant knock leads to being doused in vinegar. Most unpleasant. You must tap the barrel 
Two from the bottom, middle of the second row, in the rhythm of Helga Hufflepuff. Helga Hufflepuff. Well done. Now go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope that... you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. That was cool. How that was set up was fucking awesome. So dun 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 dun. Hell, go Hufflepuff. Oh, looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Welcome to Hogwarts. What is it? Oh, I just magically pulled an apple out of my ass. Where'd the cup go? What's oh that's the touchpad. What's options? Oh, options to save the I haven't saved. I'm gonna save my progress quickly. <laughs> Ashley says Hufflepuff Commerce. That's cool. This game's got manual saving. Oh thank God. Oh, wow. So I know they uh the devs did like a bunch of deep dives and stuff and I tried so hard not I, tr I watched a few of them when they showed off the, the common rooms but I tried not to watch too much now can I go in this one oh I can where do you leave can I steal stuff from people I know that's probably not a Hogwarts thing but that would be funny find your common room What are you? What the hell's crap? I don't have it. Rebellion. Oh. I don't know what the hell that does, but hey, that's cool. Ah, uh, they, they, uh, some introductions are in order. Hello. Oh, hello. She's awfully regal, isn't she? Is that your owl? I don't know who she is. Likely one of the Hufflepuffs around here. Owls choose their own company anyway. Wait, you're the new fifth year. Quite the dramatic entrance you made. Can't imagine wanting to call attention to yourself. Especially since everyone will be watching to see how much you already know. Huh. I have a lot of catching up. I am a bit concerned. I have a lot of catching up to do. Indeed. Four years of schoolwork is a bit... Being that far behind, I'd feel so... Inadequate. Of course, presumably, as a hard-working Hufflepuff, you'll prove yourself in no time. I'm hard-working too, as you might suspect. Sometimes right, I you give more off. Ravenclaw. I've rather a searing wit. <laughs> At least people have always told me so. I'm Lenora, by the way. Lenora Everly. Well, mustn't keep you. You've such a lot to do. Yeah. Yeah, you think you should have been a Ravenclaw? Do you really think you should have been in Ravenclaw? Well, my brothers were. They both work in the ministry now. I suppose you could say that wit runs in the family. My aunt was a Gryffindor, though, and I've always had plenty in common with her. Determination, valor, daring. The old sorting hat was spoiled for choice with me. Nice to meet it was you. nice meeting you, Lenora. Of course. Adieu. Yeah. She's kind of got like a stuck-up attitude to her. 
What's my supposed to do? Kitty! Arthur's got you. You don't it's need right. to be frightened, little cat. Uh, Kitty! I can't quite reach. Uh, come on, he went that way. Hope they can catch him. Big castle for a student to get lost in, let alone a cat. <laughs> I'm sure you'll find your way all right. I mean, it can be a bit overwhelming at first. I still get lost sometimes. <laughs> Welcome to Hufflepuff, by the way. Really glad to have you in our house. I like him. I'm Arthur. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Was that your cat? No, one of the first years, I think. Don't have any pets of my own, unfortunately. My mother doesn't think too highly of them, especially magical ones. Huh. Shame, I think magical beasts are incredible. I'm sorry Fuck to yeah. Hear that. I think magical beasts are rather incredible. Best thing about coming to Hogwarts. Nifflers, glumbumbles, bow truckles. I thought they were only pictures in books before. Well, Dad did bring home a puff skein once. Mum was furious. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I better go make sure the first years caught that cat. Don't want them to be late on their first day. Uh, have you ever had a pet? Have you ever had a pet, Arthur? No. My mother's a muggle, and as soon as the puff skein that my dad brought home stuck its tongue up her nose, it went right back to the shop. <laughs> oh. Good luck, Arthur. Nice meeting you, Arthur. And good luck finding that cat. Thank you. So far, I'm liking get him. Lost in the castle yourself. Oh, I'm definitely gonna get lost. There's like no. Oh. Oh, Uncle, this doesn't sound like you. Something's wrong. Oh, hello there. Hello. You're the new Hufflepuff, yes? I'm Adelaide. Pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Is everything all right? Oh, yes. I'm just a bit distracted. Letter from my uncle. So tell ah. me, I've been hearing all sorts of rumors. Were you really nearly gobbled up by a dragon? Yes, I was. That one is true. Not the typical start to a new school. That's dreadful. Well, I'm glad you made it here alive. Well, anyway, I imagine you have lots to do. I hope you have a wonderful first day. Thank you. Is your uncle alright? Are you sure everything is alright with your uncle? Oh, yes. He travels for work, always busy. I'm sure he just wrote it in a rush. Um, nothing to worry about. There's definitely something there. Thank you, Adelaide. Be seeing you. Of course. And good luck. Okay, I gotta Is go help that cat. Out of bed yet? Professor Weasley's waiting for them outside the common room. Oh, that's nice. Oh, it's underneath the chair. We can kind of see it. Aww. Can I talk to the... the... Hello? Oh, no, I wanted to... I wanted to talk to the ghost. I don't know who the hell the ghost is, but I wanted to talk to the ghost. Oh, that is so cool. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine Meow. what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much Meow. discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education Meow. at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. <laughs> Phoenix, what's the matter? Here you are. Wow. What the hell?
What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. What the hell was all that about? Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Okay, okay. I'm down. Ah, the door, because I'm like near it, it's like. This way. Uh, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Rebellion. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Oh. Do keep up. I look very freaking behind you. Simply cast Revelio on it, and we'll see what the guide says. Revelio. Huh. Field guide page collect. Rumor to contain some Helgen Hufflepuff's original creations. This book held a collection of Hogwarts students' favorite recipes over the centuries. Some dishes, like pit Derby plums are likely an acquired taste. You will unlock the field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges will appear here. One out of two. Field guide challenge are the only way to acquire experience or XP. What? This is your wizarding level. XP earned from challenges increase your level and power. Your field guide tries your current challenge for aggressive select the challenge. Okay. Select your first guide page unlocked. New challenge category. New challenges you can unlock through your adventures will appear here. Select the field. Okay. Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlocked each at each tier you complete from appearance to certain upgrades. Rewards can be claimed from the challenge menu. Come back to it often to uh, rewards to unlock. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Huh. Oh yeah, I wonder. Um, oh, the inventory. Okay, quest map set. Ah, oh, I like how this changed. Collections. Okay, so that's where that is. Now, my inventory. Oh, gear. Oh. Black leather gloves. Gold rim speculars. Nope. I don't like them. Okay. Outfits. Perfect vest. Huh. Wait, so where, how do you get the pre order stuff? Okay, and then the wand. Oh, standard, okay. Collection, maps, quests. Oh, I should have checked the settings originally when booting up the game, like where you get your, uh... What are you? Oh, that's all the stuff. Okay. 
cool. Probably at some point, I'll get it. Wait, ah, what? Good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. You've discarded a flame flu. Fast travel point, you can... Okay, cool. Open the map. Wow. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live and includes the house common rooms in the Great Hall. So that's the Great Hall. In this view, you can see the flu flames available in that region. Green flu flames represent flames you've discovered, including your own house comments. Gray flu flames are undiscovered. The right side of the map is where you'll find the academic points of interest, including the Astomity Tower Library and Greenhouse. Select the library. Professor Weezy has unlocked the central flu flame flames for you. Use the right stick to rotate. Oh, wow. And hit fast throw. I was say, I was nowhere near it, and I was interested. here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Huh. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. <gasps> wow. Wait, what was that? I heard it. Jingle. Oh. Okay, sorry, uh, Professor, I'm coming. Always oh, something happening here. It's the heart of the hive, our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Oh, this that sleeping dragon looks now. cool. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Um, what's Hogsmeade? You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain, and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. What the hell is butter's beer? Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Okay. Okay, charms what class. What will I learn in charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes. All terribly useful. I think you will enjoy <laughs> Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard. And a talented teacher. Hmm, thank you, Professor. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day. And you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. There is. We fact. did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. 
You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. That's right. Uh, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Yeah. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And I will. invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes yeah, yeah. today, and I'll explain more about those uh. assignments I mentioned. And we'll <laughs> see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Oh. Revelio. Yeah. Okay, so oh, I had to talk to Professor Fig. Okay. Whoa. Oh, I think somebody went out the door and then came it's back good in. Good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today, before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? Uh. Hope I didn't say too much. She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay. Uh, you can track your villa quest in the touchpad. Okay. Touchpad. Um, the icon represents the main quest. Some main quests will further the story and unlock new features and gain XP. Some quests are locked by spell or by level requirement. In, the, in these cases, you will need to be, re, to be the required level and or have the required skill to add for the quest. New skills can be earned by completing professor assignments or as quest rewards. Track a quest by hitting X. Oh, you can use the, t the touchpad. Uh, or my controller can fucking be weird. Charm class. Professor on... Okay. And... I could get lost in this castle and charm. May need to use the charmed compass to help me find a way. The Vioso. Yeah, let's go to Dark Arts. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Okay. No problem, Professor. Oh, welcome to Hogwarts. Cast the Charm Compass up on the D-pad. 
to lead you to where you need to go. Oh, that's cool. I love how like they incorporate everything uh, verse like via. Oh shit. Via like having to use magic, which I think is really cool. Defense of the Dark Gods. Rebellion. Oh, my exams. Not a one of them deserves more than a T. <laughs> Oh, wow. Oh, a field guide page. Painting of a Icarus, a uh, Lucius. This painting depicts the, depicts the young orphan wizard Lunas, who famously saved his entire village from an army of Demotors and the Dark Wizard by conjuring a mouse. Huh. Unlocked reward. Okay, challenge. Uh, a villa side quest can be found inside regions of Hogwarts marked with a gray icon and discovered by exploring the world. These quests reward XP but do not advance the main story. Wait, so wait, wait, go back, back to map, back to map. Okay, and then challenges. Here, legendary glows. Ah, so what did I get? Peering Hogwarts Spectre. Wait, so how do I? That's the collection. This is the challenge. Oh, claim reward. There we go. Okay, so I unlocked glasses. I think. Paris speculations earned by discovery. Okay. Cosmetic alterations can be applied via the change appearance option in the gear menu. Appearance in this list are rewarded as okay. Uh and, oh and the gear, okay. I figured they'd be face wear. But I already had the Weird. I don't get that. Yeah, painting. Let it update. I should go to class. Begin. Oh no. Nope. Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. That's cool. To the what? wise, age matters very little. 
Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Hmm. Study, uh, study your wand. Okay, same thing. Uh. Levioso. Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. Why do it look like I'm the only Hufflepuff in this bloody classroom? Okay. Let us begin with a basic cast. Uh... See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, Break a through the shield is a weak opponent. As Master Pruitt, so oh, he helped me demonstrate earlier. Oh, oh. So, now the basic cast. Well done. Ah, look. Good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelists. Oh, take I'm not marks. the only Hufflepuff. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. All right. Oh. <laughs> Nothing lucky about it. I know. This can't be your first duel. Oh. Let's just say I'm a quick luck. Protego. Protego. I do enjoy a lively duel. Not huh? bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. I put you on the I just wailed the shit out of challenge. Points to Hufflepuff. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I is she supposed to have like a cane or something? She's got like her hand placed like she's supposed to have like her hands on something. They must achieve it. A classroom duel is one or not. But battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Thank you, Professor. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Oh, can I actually... If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, not the other way around. Revelio. Oh, I got a unlock. Cool. What are you saying, nice friend? Nice work. Speak with Sebastian. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way, didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Uh, I've had my share of I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. You owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know... 
you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Sounds interesting. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Definitely. Pleasure Definitely. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Till next time. Till next time. Oh, you collected it. Oh, you have uncollected rewards available. Oh. Well, I had my first class. Yay! Wait, I have un. Sounds like what? Oh. Legendary cape. Legendary gloves. Okay. Now, should they be... I'm, oh, I'm guessing at some point is when I'll be able to actually change my character's look. I'm guessing right now I can't. Yeah, I collected legendary gloves. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Rebellion. Um, oh, it's great. Never mind. But I do wonder, how do we get my pre-order stuff? Oh, oh, damn. Kill enemies instantly? Okay, I don't want to see any more. I don't want to spoil myself too much. That was good. Cool. Sure Go to my charms class. I'm glad they're all in. Can I, like, bro fist that dude? Like the. Do I? Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, I had to go up on another couple of floors. Professor Ronan tends to go on a bit. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Some of us don't necessarily want him to get back to the lesson. Huh. Uh. Okay, I wonder. Here. Behind you, there is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of Chant. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right, now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays... Oh, okay, you gotta play through the open stages again, okay. <laughs> That's um, what I heard. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well... It seems that we are in dire need of review. 
Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Huh. Okay, use less stick, same like always. Point you. Ooh. Akio. 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 That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. <laughs> Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, wait, we only, I only did it once. And it she didn't have to do it. Day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. Okay. <laughs> I'm down with whatever the hell he wants to do. Oh, what's up, pray? I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> <laughs> so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Eh? What? <laughs> okay. What are we gonna do? Very simply, cast so Akio on sure. one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Okay. Uh, think of this like gobstones, Hold if you will. But instead of throwing the, the marbles up, you are summoning her closer. them toward you. The trick Out. is to pull the sphere as high as possible, but not very good. Oh. Don't lose your composure. Excellent control there. Splendid. Oh, okay. I fucked up on the first one. Very good. Points to Hufflepuff. But they're certainly very no good in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. Huh. You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Court rules. Uh -huh. Here we go. Of course, she's going to get a fifty. That is how it's done. Oh, my turn. Oh. Very good. Let us see this. She's going to get all fifties. I guarantee. Yeah. There we go. Oh, that one sucked because I wasn't holding on to it. Watch this. Oh, it stopped her. Did she hit my ball? <sighs> oh. Oh. Ah. Or what a damn it. Let can I like, this can I restart that? <laughs> interesting, shall we? Put blockers on it so it doesn't roll off on. Oh. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. 
This round settles it all. So I'll just kick my ass in the last round. Okay. She got. Oh, she got thirty. And he got pushed. Stay, stay. I will get you back for that. Okay, good. Here we go. Oh, don't you? Okay, good. Such so just can hit mine. That is how it's done. Wait, how she ha she had thirty? Oh, because the ball got knocked off. Excellent control there. Let us see this. Oh. Yeah, knew that. There we go. Tony! Woohoo! Woohoo! So I won one, she won one, so we're tied. Very good, both of you. Well done. So at least won the first. Uh, I lost the first one because I screwed up on that. F on the end there. Gather your things on the way out. You the fuck out of my class. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Thank you. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. <laughs> I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. Ladies, my mother ladies, received ladies. an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. No, Understandable. Pepperoni stick. Definitely having a pepperoni stick. It is two in the damn morning and I'm hungry. So what do we got? Uh... Ukanda. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. Huh. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention hmm. quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. Wow. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me, this enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. I like how we're having like a conversation in the middle of class. <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. Huh. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. <laughs> Until next time. Of course, you can use Akio on humans, if you're so inclined. Well, you'd be using it on clothing, to be precise, Sebastian. You know it won't work on humans. Really? A word, if you would. Okay. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me, Professor. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, 
An outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well True. managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Thank you. Completed charm class. Oh, almost Hello level. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Uh, yes. Revelio. I can't believe Black is still in the Wait. Um, yes? Hello, you wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. <laughs> I hope your first day's going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. <laughs> I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, oh. better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Hmm. Well, what the hell? Oh. I currently have nothing to do. What happened here? Reveal. Oh, yeah. Roll, which is. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. There is something. Five, twelve, three. Hmm. Rebellion. One, two, three. Hmm. Three, zero to make five. Three, three, two. So one, two, three, four, five. Which would be. I think that's the symbol. And then. The horse. Across. The horse is two. Four. Something makes twelve. I think that's the symbol. Yeah. So it's the horse. Which is probably if it goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So then it's two and then two. Three, four, five, six. That's two. Three, four, five, six. The four. And then seven. Or six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So it'd be that. Oh, but that's not in there. Oh no, it's a lit. It's like a dragon or something. Hmm. Okay. So. 
Hmm. Can I? There must be. What are you up to now? I don't know. I'm exploring. So that's most likely oh, that. Don't do that. That's not necessary. Uh. Let me also. Wait. Accio. Hmm. Well, I have nothing but this. <laughs> I don't know. There's five and twelve. I don't know what the I hell is it. Get it! Oh. Hi, pretty girl. They call it chemistry. Well then, let us go exploring. What are you? Weasley after class. Slet. So where are you? The central hall. A moth to the flame flying off the shelves. Wand handle and gold. Appearance. Oh, there's side quests. Well then. I know I could just fast travel, but fuck that. Well, that's, that's not creepy at all. Watching things come to life around me. It's cool as hell though. Oh, what are you? Hmm. to be looking for a clue perhaps you can help her investigate rebellion oh hello. hello Lenora what are you looking at everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy Samantha thinks I'm potty but it's this painting I never noticed it before if I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Hmm. Are there any other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. Ah, have you learned anything? Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Oh, perhaps I'll If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Hi, Stella. Alright. Do come and find me if you stumble on Lumos. Illuminating that, solves the that spot must be a clue. I should Ooh. look around in case it's nearby. A stairwell. Wait. 
uh, stairwell. Oh, it's a, it looks like a common room. Painting reveals an image, what appears to be location in the central hall. Oh, okay, in the central hall. We have one lock. Rebellion. Oh wait, it might be this side. Lumos. Wait, I see a chest. Okay. That is weird. Oh, it's the other side. Glad it at least tells me where I have to go. This looks like the location from the painting. Oh, she got the butterfly. So special about it. Hmm. Lumos. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Oh, I believe I found location depicted in the painting. And that's a moth that looks strictly like the ones on the carving. Ah. Oh. Ha! I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Oh, wow. Okay, it's weird. That's weird. It disappeared. All right, let's talk to Lenore. She, oh, she's up here. She didn't, like... Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Meat, although he does tend to overexplain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. I could be an Can asshole and be like, I'm not telling. I should have seen that. I leveled up. Alright, um, now do I have to keep going to my map each time to check it? Ooh, there's more. What is What's in here? What can I do? What is Speak with the mouse about the secret dueling. Oh. Okay, then there was, there's another one here. That's right. Try that. Let's do this. Has a lot of problem. Oh dear, I shall get in trouble for this. What is it, Madame? Is everything all right? Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way, and I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation, because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. Huh. That sounds a rather complicated way to simply avoid carrying your books. Possibly. But where's the fun in simplicity? New charms and spells have to come from someone. Why not me? I collect the books and remove the charm myself. Except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around. So she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. Okay. Why did Army tell Madame Scribner that they were your books? 
Oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed, bragging on my behalf. Amit spends a lot of time gazing at the stars, but he knows a good charm when he sees one. <laughs> yeah, I suppose I could help if I have the time. Cool. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. All right, all right. Collect five books off the uh, library. Now, uh, well, I was gonna say, how the fuck do I get to the library? It's like, ah, oh, the door. I'm going to have to use Akio to get to those books. Hello. Oh, excuse me. Dark Arts Dueling Gloves. Yeah, <laughs> uh, nope. Oh, nope. Yes. Oh, offense goes up. No trace plot. Oh, those look so cool. What about all the other stuff I have? Alright. Uh, wait, where were they? Akio! Got it! Only four more to go. Oh yeah, three bush at least. <laughs> Revelio. Anything in here? Oh. Hello, big chesty. There is something I'm probably gonna have to learn. Probably how to put out a fire. But Lumos. Oh, I didn't realize I did, I did that. I wonder if they ever actually explained how they do the paintings. As man, that guy, if he had to keep, if I had to be like him and keep standing in that pose, I'd get annoyed fast. Same with him. Blue flames of kid. Oh. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. <laughs> Rebellio. Oh, a lock. It's locked. Oh, wow. All right. Why does I keep hearing a charm a lot of the time when I do that? Ah. One more to go, which I think is probably on the other side. Hello, kitty. Oh, hi, pretty baby. Revelio. Oh, there's another black dark painting. Lumos. Hmm. That's in the library, but one of the big. Potato. I didn't mean to do that. 
Ah, there it is. And I just saw the book fly by. Rebellion. One of the first librarians of Hogwarts is depicted here. Rumors is that he had no tolerance whatsoever for nosy students. It was known for his liberal use of the silent charm at the slightest sneeze. Oh, <laughs> Lumos. Come, little. Are they all gonna be moths? I figured they'd be like different things. But I get the. Another field guide. Yeah. That's the last book. Now Today was a good Preston. day. That is, until Gareth splashed whatever ridiculous con concoction he was creating all over my perfectly sewed lasting flies, had to empty an entire container, entire cauldron, start all over again. Such a menace. Thinks she knows everything there is to know about potions, always disrupting Professor Sharp's class with his experiments. I'm utterly convinced if he wasn't Professor Weasley's nephew, he would have been expelled by now. Oh, I could have kept reading, I think, if I scrolled down more. Oh. Oh, she's on the other side of the library. I love how I didn't get in any trouble whatsoever for casting a spell. In the library. Oh wait, she's not here. Never mind. Hello, madame. We oh my god, I'm getting sick doing that. Right, she's be back here. That's right. I thought she was in the library. Hello, Cressida. I collected your books, including your diary. Oh, what a relief. Thank you. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. Huh. There you go. Here you are. Well, lesson learned. I certainly won't be practicing any charms in the library again anytime soon. Now, to work out where I went wrong. Perhaps I should start brushing up on my Latin. Maybe. Thank goodness, some people are trustworthy. Certainly wouldn't want anyone but me reading my diary. Yeah. Okay, I could have been an asshole, but I'm a New Year student. I'm trying to make friends. Uh, crack. Do I have anything over there? I do not. Well, it's let's go. Now what I meant to do. That portrait was empty. Oh, that's kill. All of my siblings have gone on to next school. All right, so where am I going? This way. Um, hey, you. It's about to be like, you open? Defend, oh, okay, dark arts. Found the food. So cool. Rebellion. Wee! Huh? Oh, not again. Here I've come 
from the toilet bowl where she said I could swim, did you, Praxia Mole? As long as we're only one time per week, I can plunge the boy's lavatory. Not for the meek. Please, Peas, you'll make me late. He tried to stop me, did rancorous carp, sought to trap me, confine me inside of a jar. But he failed, as did his containment charms, so I took my revenge to wreak havoc and harm. It was granted my privileges, be handsome indeed, or I'd fire up the cannon, and so she agreed. To draw up a contract with her, not with him, that if I behaved, I'd have one weekly swim! Whee! I'll get you for this. <laughs> <laughs> that was so dumb. I couldn't Rebellion. fucking resist watching it. Oh, what are you? Wait, is there an... Uh... I love how there's stuff that's lit up, but I can't like fully interact with it yet. Lucan's just over there. Oh, what are you? Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinated duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so... You must have really impressed Sebastian. Wait, what's that image? Something... Oh, sometimes maybe good, sometimes maybe shit. <laughs> ah. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does Cross Ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Oh, I'm definitely. Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Cross Ones, I like how it's like a little kid. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along, or Jewel alone. So, care to step into the ring? All Get right. me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! Definitely need to get a new larger controller. We'll make you regret signing up. Wow, aren't you people just fucking nice? Break through the yellow shields with control spells uh, like Liliosa's spell. Liliosa Tarth. Okay. Oh. Oh. Ow. Ow, god damn. Oh. I was looking at the wrong fucking person. That looks painful. Can't you try another round? Yes, I was. Don't count me out yet. Brilliant. Yeah. Crash your enemies without aiming. Yeah, ours. Yeah, that's what I fucked up on. Why not this way? Stupid. Oh, there goes my 
my wager. Ah, oh, damn it. <sighs> Pity more people can't watch the duels. Yeah. Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Thank you. Hope to see you back here again. You look at my ass kids first time. There's rewards in the menu. Rebellion. Wait, what was that? Lumos. Action. Oh, I have to do something with the door. Oh, those colors look cool. Anything here? Four more of those. Collections. Gear. Oh. Oh, it's literally buttoned up. <laughs> I've unbuttoned my shirt. Okay, uh, oh, no, map, map is what I wanted. Don't have any more side quests. I think she's in, like, no. I think she's in the main hall. So that's the library, central hall, there we go. Travel. Twenty one seventeen. Oh, I think I might get it. You might have to be this certain level. Quite get the doors though. Come on, let me up. Oh, Revelio. Feel good. The fountain of the transformation courtyard has a lightness of wavering on the top and serves as a relaxing place for students to gather. Despite rumors of the uh, contrary, possibly. Starting by some Sir Catherine, this is the most accurate, not meant to be the wavering line stained by the lively knights of the spirit. Oh. Kitty! I will kitty. Oh. And no, oh, my, my kitties are all passed out. Begin quest. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Bab, 
Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Uh... Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details. Mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Uh... Professor yeah, much Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. All right. Can you tell me more about the potions shop, Professor? J. Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Professor Sharp asks that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. Hmm. I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. Okay. There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. Hmm. I'm ready to go. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, mm. your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. What the hell is butterbeer? Speed Professor to receive your first assignment. Assignments are types of quests given to you by Hogwarts professors that when completed reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the Mendian Charm, Reparo, which is required to complete other quests. You can track assignments to the progress in the quest in your field guide. Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that, the Mending Charm, Reparo. Fixes things right up, Makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to oh. do so as well. But first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. 
I have huh. arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Rapero in no time. All right. What is the purpose? Why must I first complete tasks to learn Rapero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first hand experience. And these tasks should provide you with just that. Excuse me. Such experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. Hmm. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Alright, collect the flying papers near the broken statue. Collect flying papers near the defense dark arts. Uh, okay. Oh, 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 that one over there. Okay, okay, okay. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Revelio. Accio. Got it. All right. In the dark heart, which isn't too far from me. Ah, there we go. Discover that. A flying page must be around here somewhere. Revelio. Ah, there it is. Brilliant. Wait, did I? I completed something, which I think I completed a challenge. I did. I trust the preliminary tasks weren't. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Indeed. Remember, your wand oh. is a conduit of your magic. A mending charm repair can be used to mend broken objects and place pieces of the environment. Oh, <laughs> that is so cool. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Oh, maybe. Repair. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> huh. I wonder what she's supposed to be screaming at. Wait, wait, wait. Rebellion. Anyway. Oh, it must be something else, like a spell I get where I can move stuff. Whilst I'm impressed by your one work, I would suggest you set your aim a bit further from your professor. I didn't mean to actually hit the thing, but that was still fun. Okay. No active quests. Rebellion. Uh, 
Oh. Okay. Oh, what's this? Gobs, the gobstone is floating over. Oh, fettering over her missing gobstones. A wand handle. I shall help a student in need before venturing off to finish whatever the hell I'm doing. Also, I think over here I have to get the thing in the classroom. If only a new student would help me with my stock <laughs> I think it was in here. Said in somebody's classroom, or no, oh wait, that might not be her classroom. Might be uh, the other t the dark arts nice classroom. To see you, my young friend. Glad I just phased through them. I phased through people. Makes uh, getting around a lot easier. Another painting. Oh wait, maybe down here. Oh, she's a kitty. I know where she is. I just want to find that last uh, thing for the classroom. So I think possibly in his room. Oh, he's up here now. Professor, do you have time to chat? I always have time for my students. How may I help you? Huh. I wondered if I might ask how long you've been teaching at Hogwarts. Well, it's been what now? <laughs> Seven swift years. Time does fly because we have fun. Essential in my opinion. An eager, positive and confident mind is the most open to knowledge, I find. Hmm. Some of the professors may not agree with your approach. <laughs> well, each of us has our own style, I suppose. Some in oh, the teaching his wand field believe that hard work and dedication are the only keys to success. But they forget what drives those things. Yeah. If one cannot fathom why some would expend energy on gobstones, Coming up. then one is blind to the enormous power of play. And that's why you teach the way you do. Precisely. I strive to be the sort of professor oh, he's supposed to be holding his wand, enjoyed in school. but it, I don't, I don't think it's like registered in. Less cheerful. Huh. I'm sorry to hear that, sir. It sounds as if your experience as a student was less than ideal. Had I received a more traditional education, well... <laughs> Enough about my student days. You are here. So again, now. I think it's and because it be a shame this character is not supposed it. to be holding his I'll wand best, to where the Thank version of him advice. outside <laughs> holding the wand is Try actually holding the, the wand. Today. <laughs> I think that was. Uh, yeah, I think that's what's going on there. <laughs> He's not supposed to be holding the wand at this instance. But where. It did say I'm missing a thing here. Professor face classroom. Oh, okay. Oh, down. Ah, over here. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Thank you. I need to get lock picking for that, okay. Bam bam do 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 be nice if I could yeah, kind of can't just jump off a cliff like a psychopath. <laughs> We're playing Hogwarts, not uh, Assassin's Creed. Might some kind soul help me? Are you all right? 
Don't you know who I am? Zenobia Oak. The girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. Why does everybody hate Everyone hates you. Why? Because Hogwarts is full of bullies and spoil sports. Leander Pruitt's one of the worst, that no-talent moon mind. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. Hmm, gobstones. Sounds like a fun challenge. That's what I tried to tell everyone. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault for losing. Imelda is one of the worst losers. Ever written a story or a terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. Ah. Huh. Rather an overreaction on their part. I'll say. A wee bit. Anyway, I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone, perhaps a selfless and talented fifth year, to help me. Uh, any ideas? Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gobstones down from their hiding spots? If I knew that, I'd get them myself. Whoever hid my gobstones that high got up there somehow. Hmm. Haven't you any friends at school? Not really. Natty said hello once, but not a word since. I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do find all of my gobstones, do come and see me again. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. Wow, that sounds very, very depressing. Gobstone said, okay, other students have hid them. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Revelio. Exactly like, how high are we talking? Oh, one's supposed to be out here. Oh. Revelio. Accio. Repair. Uh, nope. So that's it. They may have some else. Oh, I don't. Said the other students hid them at a bridge. They must have used magic to do so. Accio. Repair. Hmm. So it's there, but I can't do anything at the moment. So I'll have to come back at a later date. Well then, let's go to the village, or town, or Hogsmeade, that's the word I was looking for. Rebellion. Huh. Interesting. Wow. Hello. Looking for me? 
Go on, run. Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. Sweet. I want to know about this butterbeer. Oh, it's raining. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Really? Yes. I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a butterbee in the village. <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. I cannot tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. Grave mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. I believe you. Though I suppose you would not really call it elective when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. <laughs> oh, I thought that was something else. I was like, wait. It is beautiful this time of year. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas. But that's one of the few times of year I would rather be indoors. <laughs> <laughs> not much for the cold, are you? Oh, I do not mind the cold so much. But it has taken some getting used to. I did not grow up around snow. Well, as a Canadian, uh, we oh, wait, over here. grow around snow all I the time. I often spot lacewing <laughs> flies in this area. Oh? What's so special about them? They are interesting to look at, but if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Really? <laughs> interesting. Oh, it's so pretty. From the Forbidden Forest. Hippogriffs. I wonder if something startled them. I heard rumors that Hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. You think Poppy's already seen the Hippogriffs? Absolutely. Likely already named them too. Prance Hoof and Sugarfoot. Hmm. That's the Forbidden Forest on the left. It's off limits to students, as the name implies. <laughs> Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Ah, there's Hogsmeade over the crest, past that ruin. Oh, I would yeah, spend okay. all of my time exploring if I could. I confess, I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively new here. She said that? Hmm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal in class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. Oh, oh that's cool. How are you settling in? I remember the weeks that followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything was Could uh, lake. new and unfamiliar. I'm getting used to things. What about you? Do you finally feel settled? I still miss my homeland, but it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully it will for you too. I hope so, too. Mr. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, huh? Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss on I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. 
What did Mr. Moon? Jemmy, guys, Dougly and Arian. Mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. He's a caretaker? Oh, Mr. Moon, a Demi guys. I think he had too much fun in the village. I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. Huh. Nearly there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just Hogsmeade. I am happy to explore whenever you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I'll keep that in mind, Natty. Thank you. And here we are. It is hard to know where to start. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter beer. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. Rebellion. I can tell you that you are certain to find every. Oh, sorry. Uh, this particular stack of set of cauldrons outside the cottage advertises the shop wares. It can be noted that the stacking cauldrons in this fashion, well, admittedly eye-catching, is ill-advised for anyone wishing to brew a potion of any intended effect. Hmm. Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spellcraft, some seeds, and... A new wand. Of course. You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Thank you. Enjoy okay. yourself. I will see you soon. Hogsmeade Village is pretty much different. Oh. Different sites, shops, and other points of interest that you can navigate using the field guide. Wow. Hogsmeade map shows the shops and points of interest. You can track these points of interest pretty nice. Ooh. Potions. A hogshead. Okay. Lavenders. With sporting needs, wizardry, Madame Pilium, beast supply shop stocked with the latest and greatest beasts, and then just little things, tomes and scrolls. Huh. Very, very cool. I get lost Rebellion. in this place. Oh. Feel that? Frequent regularly by Hogwarts students and village lazelings. Uh, Zoko's is the place to buy pranks and jokes in Hogsmeade. Field guide and always Rebellion. <laughs> Wait, where exactly am I at the moment? Ah, okay, I'm where I wanted to kind of go. Huh? Not to go down that path. Miss Peck from Brood and Peck said a customer lost a Dirichul around here. I know we're not supposed to go down there. I just thought. Oh, I have to come back later. Oh. She said I might earn a reward. Rebellion. 
Instead, I just wasted our time. There you are! Ha! Huh. Finally! I'll have enough for that wind wisp. Ah, well, not meant to be. Also, I may have knocked over a dustbin back there. Um, you seem mad. Lumos. Accio. Revelio. Repairo. Levioso. Wow, that seems to be a pissed off chest. Okay, so we gotta look for our stuff. I'm just trying to practice. Oh, it's a barber shop. Rebellion. How do I get into the barber shop? I have other wishes. Maybe a different entrance? Possibly a different entrance. Okay, visit that, potions, so, yeah, potions, barber, this, tailor, hmm. Rebellion. I have no idea what is that. Well, that's creepy. <laughs> Imagine Nib, how are supplies for fresh? Okay, so I need to go here for seeds. <laughs> oh, that's. Uh, oh. Oh, it's the. Oh, oh, no, I did see one. Gotta wait for it to come back. Get back. It's a bird, so I'm really just wondering where that last page is going to be. Well, hello there. Hello. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Ah, oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Yep. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way, and this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. Hmm. In addition to I love how when everybody introduces them to Growing themselves to me, they always say the first and last name. potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But... What say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Oh, what else have we got here? Flux wheat seeds, not grass seeds, mallow sweets. Sherry, what are you? Fertilizer? Oh, plants. Oh, this is what they grow into. What's in here? Oh, stuff I can possibly sell. Okay. Uh, purchase. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Uh, 300 gold for fertilizer? Man, you a rip off. Okay, cheap skate asshole. 
I know we're being in Hogwarts, but why is the world gotta be like the normal economy? Where everything's goddamn expensive. I don't know, is this where I gotta go? Welcome to J. Pippin's Pushins. Hi. Oh, I do have to come here. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's mm. your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses. And I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Definitely. What can I do for you today? All right, what do we got? Uh, recipe for healing potions. Recipe for a potion that causes a rocky film to develop on the consumer's skin, helping protect them from harm. Thank Feel God this trick is free. Rest of my inventory, or come back another Do time the if you're in a rush today. Spell cooldown. Got a berry recipe for powerful damage potion. This for making the trigger partially visible. Okay. Dedicated wings for those focuses potions that can only be found in the field. Oh, I, I, okay, I heard that. Dumb bog tongue. Oh, Jesus. Trolls boogies. What the hell is this? Dench of the dead. Uh, a spider's fang, leech juice, focus potion, maximum potion, crucial trigger, spell damage for a limited time, age and healing restores a bit of the trigger's health. How much do you want? Three, a hundred. Hmm. I have eight now. When the hell did I go from three to eight? All right, Ollivander, which if I remember correctly, Ollivander was up. Ollivander is actually to my right. Down over here. Is that a mailbox? Oh, it's a trash, I think it's a trash one. I think I passed all of that. You certainly never revealed the charm of my potions, Professor, back when I was at school. Uh, definitely feel like I passed it. I did. Okay, so it's out. So I did actually pass it. But I'm curious to see where I find the last page. Ah, there you are. Never mind, you were not the last page. I thought you were. Well then, I think I shall explore and see if I find it. I'm basically just running around clicking R3. <laughs> Hmm. 
Yeah, so yeah, all vendors. Look at them all. Ow. I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Ah, mm. hello, sir. I'm looking for for a new wand. Yes, it's about time. Yes, I... about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivander's, I'm sure. Finest one makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Hmm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes, hmm, powerful core. Ten and a half inches? Hmm. You might do. You might do. Yeah. Give this one a try. Well, go ahead. Swish. Hmm. How odd. Uh, once more. Come on. Really swish it. Okay. Am I supposed to be... Yeah. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> no, 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 um, definitely not. Good at parties. Something not to worry. Mm. <laughs> no, not you. Uh, uh, mm, perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, thirteen and three quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. <laughs> Goodness. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. This is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where Should I you? maybe hold out my hand and see, see if the wand comes to me? Ah, there you are. Think you might be the one. What? Why is it? Yeah. It's all. Take it. The uh, all the cases are. Um. Okay, I'm liking that already. A crooked spiral, dark gray. But yeah, how is it they're all like green cased? Dragon heart string. So it's the same thing. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I had to change it. Curious indeed. Gray, brown, honey, dark. That's cool. How intriguing. Gray. Oh, yeah, I didn't read that. Warm brown, gray, classic light brown, brown, honey. I kind of I like this. I like the standard, like, bro crooked spiral to it. Curious type. indeed. Wait, maple? Wait, let's see, what are all the ones? How Elder, intriguing. Ash, Aspen, Breach, Walnut, Cedar, Cherry, Chestnut, Cypress, Dogwood, Ebony. Ooh, I like the wood Curious type there. Indeed. Helm, English Oak. Red oak, okay. How intriguing. Well, seeing that I'm ginger and Canadian, I'm gonna go maple. Thanks. Curious indeed. So you can have up to nine and a half inches, all the way up to fourteen and a half inches. How intriguing. Oh yeah, it's a thirteen and then flexibility. Slightly springy, swishy, super squishy, quite bendy. 
all the way to unyielding, be. slightly yielding, unbending, stiff, solid, hard, brittle. Oh. How intriguing. I don't understand the flesh ability, but let's go solid. So is this. The hair of the unicorn that serves as the core of the wand, known for producing constant magic. The dragon heart strain that serves as the core of the wand, known for producing powerful magic. The feather of the phoenix that serves as the core of the wand, capable of producing a great range of magic. Oh, I'm definitely gonna go a on. dragon heart string wand is most powerful and learns quickly. Oh, oh, he doesn't say anything else. Really? Hmm. A unicorn hair wand is most reliable and faithful to its owner. Come on. Ah, there we go. Phoenix feather, exceptionally rare, and a core with a strong sense of initiative. Yeah, I'm definitely going this one. What do you think? <laughs> yeah. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> now. How did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager oh, to try Oh, that's out. cool. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new one's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. I shall, I shall. Can I chat with him now? Probably not. Visit scrolls and tomes, which I think is down here. Um, ah, here it is. Tomes and scrolls. An inquiring mind. Revelio. Feel that. This enchanted staircase in Tomes and Scrolls reveals itself within a particular bookish mood. The prototyper here, Tom Thomas Brown, says various are written production products, including spellcraft handy for con. Oh, there's I think the last book I need that's floating around. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda's student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Yeah, the proprietor. Thomas Brown. I, I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something <sighs> out of nothing. Of course, mm -hmm. it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. 
Reja. Nothing like oh. being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Wait, but wouldn't that be the purpose of like have, stores? Holy shit! Beast toy box. All its ability to conjure a potting table with a small pot. Use this pot to grow all sorts of useful magical plants. Ability to conjure a small potion station, perfectly suited for all your potion brewing needs. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. What was this? What well, this? That's uh... everything. Better go and find Natty. Hmm. What is this? Oh. All the different pots. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> now I wonder, Ashley, now... Oh, I probably got something. Oh, yeah, a couple of things. Sewing sheep, okay. Sewing hat. Who got paid in hollow mead? There's a thing for Hogsmeade I needed. All right. Rebellion. There's the book. The last page I think it was. It was flying back there. Oh, I don't think anyone at the moment is There you are. Ah, oh, one of fifteen again. Lumos. Well, that's by the, I think, the dock. Yeah, I think that was over here. Itchy ear. That was weird. Ah, I found it. Oh, yeah, this is the lock symbol. The locks that are moving. So these count as well towards I thought it'd be just the flying pages but apparently not being an officer of the law Oh. 
So I'm guessing when I'm not coming in during a quest or anything, when I can actually freely explore, I probably go into all the other places. Ah, oh, I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Oh. Oh. the punches Just ride the troll attack Goodness, a second troll did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves I suppose so it's all a bit of a blur to be honest Merlin's beard are you all right we are and we were glad to help I'd say help is a bit of an understatement nerve like that the makings of an aura if you ask me if you are unharmed Perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. I love how she's talking to me and not talking to her. Alright. Oh, hello there. Repair uh, A moment if you I will see what he wants. Uh... Very, very cool. Repair. I'm glad I'm when I just hit for Officer Singer to worry about. I'm glad, like when I hit Reparo, it just does it, and I can like walk away. Okay, what else is? Five. Oh. Lucky they didn't do more damage. Oh. Repair. There we go. What did the shopkeep want? 
We were just talking about you. Ah. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothia Extraordinary. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. Yeah. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. Close. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were, life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Well, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Okay, but what about my pre-order shite? <laughs> Wizard hat, scarf, nomad hat. Oh, 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 oh! So sick stuff. Level one. Preview gear. Wait, I don't get it. What am I previewing? Oh, it's the set of robes. You received new piece of gear, equip it with your touchpad. Any options? Okay. Your current defense and offense are displayed at the top right of the screen. Set the robe. Oh, yeah, one's hand. Okay, so that's a robe. Equip the new robe. What are you? Oh, a level. Level seven. And then stuff I can sell. Wait, I have that equipped. Why is it I can, I can sell stuff that I have what equipped? What an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeat. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butter beer. Shall we head to the three broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way then. Hmm. I sell even more battle revellions. Should you be inclined, you're most welcome to. Unlike the enhanced enchanted mannequins featured by students for dealing practice, the mannequins at Galfrey's serve only as a means to display the latest wizard fashion. At your leisure. What is the bag over here? Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and a powerful witch. Wow. Good one to know. What Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Yes, what do you have? But again, why can I? Oh, not inventory. I want a gear. That's right. The wand. Oh. A marvelous twisting handle designed to dark gray tossed with a silver owl. I can see my fingertips. It sucks that I can't like transmog kind of thing. I might be able to. Because I really, really like the looks of those gloves.
Oh, okay. I can't. After seven, no upgrades, no traits. I wear nothing. Head wears the, that. Scarf I don't care for. Same Plenty top. Plenty perusal today. Take your time. I'm gonna keep that. Because again, I wonder if I'll be able to actually get the inability to do that. Rebellion. <laughs> That's cool. Oh. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. <sighs> Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. It's a oh. treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank That's you, Serona. You be well. That's how you do it. Now, what can I... Oh. There's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Oh, that's lead. the character that apparently is, uh... Transgender. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single-handedly has made fun control. of the Is that right? author, well author of Thanks for this. Um, Hogwarts. I will say, J.K. Rowling. Yeah, J.K. Rowling. In Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with. Are, uh, uh, what time, Lane? Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. No, nope, not really. Us. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. 
Can I get a top hat? I really want a top hat. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Thanks. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. Some quests are open out with no compass path. Set a personal waypoint to the map to track your location. Alright, now there was the way I was look I just looked it up actually. So there it is. Change appearance. Black leather gloves in my collection. The legendary gloves, the dark arch gloves. Yeah, there it is. So I don't actually need to have the... Because I don't have the leather gloves on me anymore. So any outfit I've seen... that That's cool. I can change whenever I want. Can I change the appearance of this? That's how you change it. Definitely doing the dark arts. What about my t-shirt? Dark arts essence. Um, bad per okay, all the other vests I've got. Yeah, definitely going full dark arts here. Holy shit, this stuff looks awesome. Uh, oh yeah, and I got rid of my hat. That's why I think they give you a hat and glasses. Oh, that's cool. Why is my... Side of the three brooms. I am certainly glad Serona was there. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Brookwood and Harlow. I want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. I don't blame you. You must return to the common room for the night, Ash, with the map. Okay. Let Hogwarts map button by switching to Hogwarts. Okay. Clear fast route to the your common room. To the Great Hall. Hufflepuff. Common room. I had an eventful first day. I leveled up. Okay, well, what I'm going to do, actually... I hit the wrong button. So, options brings me to this. Okay. Or we got some. Gear. My shirt. I'll at least wear the Hufflepuff shirt. Definitely wear that one. I like that. Uh, I want to wear that. And for pushing the boundaries of magic, some of those who poison refined are by solving the mysteries. Yeah, definitely walk around like that. You received an owl post. 
Professor Fake, come see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found. Okay. R3 to read. Well, then I'll go see the Professor Fig. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Oh. oh. I have never encountered an aura quite like yours. You are truly exceptional. Well, thank you. Rebellion. Oh, I know. This one. That was it. Oh, hello, Paige. Where are you going? Your spirit guides are trying to contact you. I can sense them all around. That is so cool to see. Ah, now that I got a hat. Gear, I want to see something. Equip the hat. Change the appearance. Ah, that's how it is. Dark eyes hat, dark garrison hat. So there are, so there's a hat to the outfit. And then, because I had the Dark flat cap, get that, and this is the standard hat. Then I don't actually need to have a hat. So we can have a hat on and have invisible on it, so I don't actually need to. Huh. Oh, I don't even need that on. And then I can turn this on. Uh, <laughs> no, I'll turn that off. That is actually pretty cool. I like that. I like the outfit, especially that. With the dark arch outfit, looks really nice. But I do like how you can actually turn your stuff off if you don't like it. So that's what I'm actually wearing. But I do like that jacket. And then the hat. That isn't really much of like that is cool actually. In touch with the darkest side of magic, darker side of magic. I did say I want a top hat. But I'll keep my hat invisible. So I think Right now, actually, I think what I'll do, even though I did pre-order it, I will wear, because now knowing that, I will wear the actual robe. Yeah, I'll wear the robe for, like, a little bit. So I think that's what, like, a lot of people do anyways with the pre-order bonuses. And all that is they'll stick to wearing, like, the robes that they wear. How was that?
love how I'm supposed to, like I'm basically being taken on an adventure. Though if I went to the common room first, probably would have saved myself a trip. Oh, I could have actually, yeah, just fast traveled here. Very cool. Yeah, I could have just fast traveled because it was right there. Oh, this looks like oh, Wow Wait Really I just sat on the floor Huh, Where, wait, why, why is there blue? Oh, the ancient magic. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have had Serona and the patrons at the Three Brumsticks not intervened. This is great news indeed. Hmm. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Huh. Speaking of the vault... Do you think that Ranrock is working with any of the goblins at Gringotts? I do not. Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. No, I dare say after what happened to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. That's good. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure, but I do not know where it leads. It hmm. leads to the library. A restricted section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit before we continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. Yes, sir. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. You know what? I changed my mind. I really like the dark arts background. I think it's fucking awesome. Boy, I should actually... Rebellion. See, is there anything in here? Well, that's creepy in all sorts of different levels. Forge Professor Hactics. Professor Fig. As if my schedule wasn't contested enough, the Ministry has charged me with arranging the rather inconvenient arrival of a new student of hogwarts a fifth year if you can believe professor weasley insists that we need to as an escort and mentor to help them accumulate their it should have asked you 
like what your pronouns they're gonna be because it's kind of dumb when they're like it says them it's like well i'm a guy so it should be like say help him though again they don't particularly at this point know who the hell i am i assigned the task for you please help see professor weasley for details rebellion Okay, so I'm going where? <laughs> oh, there's the Stai Wing. Catchy in the castle. Oh. Wait, we saw him? I didn't see him. there perhaps you can help me okay what Hello. do you want Hello. were you calling me i was yes thought perhaps a fellow hufflepuff might have the perseverance to join me in a bit of an adventure following a treasure map to be precise slight respite from battling the odd troll i should think asked poppy if she'd be interested as well but couldn't drag her away from her puff skein i found two maps lying about both leading to locations around hogwarts Care to have a look at one? Sure. Following a Hogwarts treasure map. Count me in. Wonderful. Hogwarts fascinates me. You can keep whatever treasure lies at the end of your map. I'll be satisfied just knowing where it leads. Okay. Any ideas for sure? Where do you suggest I search first? Hmm. Based on a cursory review of your map, I'd suggest somewhere near Hecate's classroom. Okay. Very well. I shall take a look if I can find the time. Fair enough. Meet me back here if you find anything. <sighs> oh, excuse me. That's the courtroom. Or courtyard. Okay, so... Statue... Go around, go to that behind there. Okay. Find the first landmark. Oh, wait, landmark. Okay. Um, God damn it. I was hoping. Shows a not. Oh, yeah. Okay. On display, which was. At least a dozen times, yeah. It is. Get away from... what are it's you like way. Ah, here it is. Ah, a rhinoceros skeleton. I'm on the right track. Suppose a dra uh, by the dragon found, yeah. Here in the background makes me think. Yeah, the courtroom. I'd better keep an eye on high places. There's the fountain. I'm getting closer. The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? Oh, a new kitty. Oh, a pet a kitty. Oh. And it looks like Revelio. You, you can't that. imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented the uh, Treasure map is once. So look at the stairwells going up. The stairwell looks promising. <laughs> this looks like the portrait from the map. And where's the treasure? Lumos. Oh. 
Can you hide something on third map? Just a bit of magic. You need to reveal a secret. Levioso. Oh. Wait, why did I do that? Repower. Aqua. Lumos. Whoa. There was a doorway hidden within the portrait. Oh. I wonder what came of Arthur's search. I found a piece of gear. Oh, I found a look for it. Oh, that's cool. Revelio. Keep hitting the wrong button when I want to do that. The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? Not particularly sure if I need to like if I can talk well I probably could. Talk to her. I like, talked to the girl that I just ran past about the keys. So I don't think that'll affect my quest I'm on at the moment. It's about time Hogwarts put someone Find anything yet? I did. Hello, Arthur. Thought you might like to know that my map led to a doorway hidden within a portrait. Oh, how clever! Mine led to the boathouse. Barely found the treasure before I saw the headmaster coming. He shooed me out of there, but not before I got a few galleons richer. What did you find? I found what I believe is an authentic historian's uniform. Oh, that's lucky! Seems as though we both had success. Glad I enlisted you to join me. <laughs> well, on to the next Hogwarts mystery. Wonder if a quick rummage round Weasley's office might yield anything interesting. I wish the headmaster would retire. Let Professor Weasley take over for him. Oh, pet kitty. Aww. Sucks the haptic feedback doesn't let me like, feel the purring. Actually, I wonder about that. Is haptic feedback even turned on? Oh, that that's a thing I should do. Use your wireless controller motion sensor function when flying. Nope. Definitely not that one. Okay. Uh, now there is a one of the students out down here.
Ah, here. The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? Is everything all right? Yes, I'm sorry. I'm just... I'm Nelly, by the way. I'm just so excited that the Dedalian keys are back. The what keys? The Dedalian keys. Surely you've seen them flying about. Rumor is that a former headmistress, Professor Mong, conjured them to protect the contents of certain locked cabinets years ago. Professor Black couldn't be bothered to disenchant the keys, and they appear every few years. You should try to catch one. Why would I do that? Each key will lead you to a locked cabinet somewhere in the castle. If you can manage to get the key into the cabinet lock, not an easy task, you may find a reward. Huh. Why would Professor Mole conjure flying keys? What I heard is that it had something to do with keeping peeves out of things. But that may or may not be true. He's a poltergeist. I thought they could go almost anywhere. Surely you will be trying to complete the challenge as well. Ah, oh, I've tried. And I can't even get past the first cabinets. Perhaps you'll have better luck. I'd love to know what's in the cabinets. Oh, I'll see you later. Perhaps I'll give it a go. I hope you do. In fact, I think I heard one of the keys in the astronomy tower. You should listen for them. I hope you follow a few keys at least. If you manage to open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find, if anything. Okay. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Yeah, I need to probably get something that allow me to grab. So Let's go, uh, let's go try this. See what the hell it is. God, I've been doing more, I think, side questing than anything and helping the students. It's so fucking awesome to do. All of my relatives work. I wonder if I'll learn more about the doors. And this thing. Wow, that's cool. Huh. Oh, wait. Revelio. This tapestry depicts the wizard, Balthus the Barm's foolish attempt to train trolls for the ballot. One can only imagine the impact on the arts had he succeeded. That's a definitely thing. What's that? Wow. How goddamn high is this key supposed to be? Oh. I heard it. That's a Dalian key. I wonder where it might lead me. I lost it. Oh. There's the cabinet. It. How do I get this key in there? Oh. Oh. Huh. Oh, I think I have to wait for it to like fly. 
like Ah, uh, okay, I have to time it. Um... Damn it! Well, that didn't work. Oh, we're definitely not reading all that. Rebellio. Hmm. Found the cabin door. You now to try and open it. Yeah. Brilliant. There we go. An old coin. Perhaps Nelly knows what it means. What are you up to? Okay, uh... Wait. Yeah, Nelly, open that, track that. Fast travel. Oh wait, there's a thing outside in the courtyard. I could have fast traveled to that. Oh, it's right here, actually. This is what I was trying to do. Were you able to follow one of the Dedalian keys? Well, yes. Hello, Nelly. I managed to get a Dedalian key into its lock. Brilliant. What did you find in the cabinet? A curious token of some sort. Looks like some sort of house token. I bet it unlocks house chests. I call them house chests. I've seen the one in Gryffindor and heard they're also in the other common rooms as well. Keep an eye out. I do hope you continue on. For okay. so much effort, the prize must be something grand. I should see this through and find the Hufflepuff house. I should see this through and find the Hufflepuff house chest. Oh, okay. Which would probably be best if I just fucking fast travel to it. Oh, fast travel. Insert the key. Tuck it in your house. This must be my house chest. I just need to insert the token. Seems I'll need to find more house tokens if I'm to open this. Quite a few by the look of it. Sixteen. Shit. That's a lot of damn house keys. All right. Where else is a side quest? Oh, it has an assignment, okay. Nope. I got a school assignment. Um, ah, I was just like, where the hell am I going? Oh, ah, where are you going, little friend? You're going up. Handy resource indeed. Your field. Revelio. Oh, wait, shit, I think I have to reset it. It flew upwards. I'm not particularly sure. Oh, I hear it. Oh, 
Oh, did it? Oh, I wonder if it reset. Did I lost it? I'm trying to kind of pan the camera to see if it's back there or not. No, so it's flying around. Revelio. Nope. Nope. That kitty's changed again. That's the kitty. Can I skip this? No. Okay, good. I don't get where the hell that key went. Yeah, I have like absolutely no idea where it disappeared to. Frankly, I'd rather limit my excursions. I've always said that travel. Well, whatever. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell. Handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs, and, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds uh, versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. Yeah, thank you, madame. You know where to find me once you've finished. When two rounds of the crossed wands... Seems crossed wands isn't as secret as it's believed to be. Complete a round of spell combination practice with Lucan and Pratty. Hmm. Huh. So far, that's the only thing that's annoying me in this game is the fucking doors. It's like the doors are supposed to open, but it's like kind of waiting a few seconds. I love how there's a day night cycle. I think so. We shall see who shows up. I know, Sebastian, I know. Uh. Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of Crossed Wands all set? Why, yes it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? Uh, sure. I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? Uh... Sure. Yes, Natty. Then let's get to it. Well, I don't. I didn't have to ask. Ready to get thrashed? Oh, it's, 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 Apologies in advance. Three. When breaking through shields with the four spells, on the charm of Acapo. Ah, go target, okay. Oh, ah. Oh. Ah, damn.
Oh, that's how you do it. It was down. I forgot how to. What? Ow. Ah. Uh, I shouldn't say it. What the hell kind of... I've already taken notice of you, but after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. You'd better huh. keep practicing if you want a chance of winning, or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Alright. Complete a round. A spell combination practice with Lucas. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? Uh, yes. That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Okay. So it's repair. Oh. Oh, I think that's basic. Yeah. That's it. Ah, okay. So that's it. All right. Let me go. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. Assignment's all finished. I love that. Repair of Lumos. Hmm. I have no idea what the hell that did. <laughs> Probably nothing. Like, it would be nice when stuff like that, it would, like, indicate kind of, like, a little bit of, like, what spell you should use. Because it's kind of annoying, it's like, having to run through and just trying to figure out which one you're supposed to be using.
I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate you and that you found success in your endeavors. Indeed, I did. I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hackett. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. Yes, ma'am. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. Yes, ma'am. Okay, run my shirt. All right. Uh... Incendio. You have learned enough spells that you need to equip Incendio to spell set. To do this, you need to swap spells to different spells. Good work. Okay. Uh, to use a spell or item, you must first add it to the spell set, add Insignia, hover over it, and hold R2. Okay. And replace and hit the button where you want to replace it. Uh, I'll do Repairo. For right now. Wait, what's this one? Oh, that's what I might have to use to get it. Or what's this? Astro movement. Freeze enemies. Uh. Basic casting. Excuse me. Oh. Gain access to various locked rooms. Stealth. Well, what is that? You have uncollected rewards. Incendio. Oh. He heavy damage spell. Keep at it, and do try not to incinerate yourself. I'll return to Mr. Faith, Professor Faith. All right. How nice to see you, my young friend. And you too. I'm not particularly sure where he that thing flew to. Incendio. Accio. Levioso. Lumos. Apparently, I passed it all day, all night on this floor. 
Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Heckard. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. <sighs> that said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, shall we proceed? Fig, I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule Your is... schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office, five minutes. That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. But, Professor... We have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. Yes, sir. Talk to Sebastian. Hmm. What will I learn? Sebastian mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. Oh, maybe. I don't even play them fucking for four hours. Ah, Sebastian, my friend. Sebastian, there you are. I was hoping to see you. I was in the three broomsticks after the troll attack and saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow. Not many students have Victor Rookwood's attention. What was that all about? Uh... Seems he's working with Ranrock, and Ranrock is after something I found at Gringotts. Ranrock? And when were you at Gringotts? Professor Fig and I ended up there after the dragon attack. It's quite the tale. Fig had this port key. A port key? To Gringotts? I'm not sure I follow. I barely follow myself, and I was there. Anyway, we ended up in an ancient vault where we found a map. That map leads to the restricted section. You can't be serious. Deadly serious. Professor Fig has insisted that I not tell a soul about any of this. I've probably said too much. Understood. Your secret's safe with me. Whatever it is. Thank you, Sebastian. Huh. You mentioned being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section. And I am. Meet me outside the library tonight. And tell no one. Hmm. How concerned should I be about the librarian? Madam Scribner doesn't take kindly to clandestine activities taking place amongst her precious books. So do all that you can to avoid her. She and I have had our entanglements, but I can hold my own against her. You may not be so lucky. Okay. What will happen if we're caught in the restricted section? Detention, no doubt. But a word of caution or two will help. For one, avoid Peeves, the poltergeist. Aside from wanton destruction of property, he loves nothing more than telling on the likes of us. Hmm. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. I was just gonna go straight to nighttime. Oh, yeah. See there? That's the door we need to reach. And those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner. So don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. Let's go. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. The disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. Cast it and you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light. Just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean I'll hmm. actually be able to turn invisible? Something like that. It's not as foolproof as a cloak, but those are expensive. And spells, spells are free. Give it a try. Okay. Oh. Oh. 
using this lens to avoid being detected in the off-limits areas. Ah, uh, okay, disillumment. Hold to a sign. Hmm. Uh, we'll do... Say top. Nearby... Adversaries, uh, adversaries will sense and then investigate suspicious behavior being caught by authority figures will reset result in quest failure. Hi again. Okay, so that's what was supposed to happen. I'm supposed to wait. I don't know if it rightly matters. I'm guessing I have to wait till like that one goes back to the other side. Cause they do that, it's like they'll turn around. Still be all right. Do you see her desk behind me? Uh -huh. The key is in the drawer of that desk. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'll create a distraction to draw her away. You focus on getting the key. I'll meet you outside of the restricted section. Good idea. You distract. I get the key. Understood. I said I'd get you in, and I always keep my word. Trust me. <laughs> Oh, okay, didn't have to do that. Oh, I heard that key. Is someone there? Is that you, Peeves? Pick up, Professor Black. The key. Here it is. Huh. Time to get the hell out of there. That wasn't so difficult after all. Now to find that book. Ah. Oh, hello. Oh, that one's charmed to look more useful than it is. It's fooled me twice. 
Never judge a tome by its cover, I say. Hmm. I love how you can actually interact with this stuff, too, which is neat. But the question is, what book am I particularly looking for? Use basic cast while under, undetected to lure authority figures and enemies to a desired location. Or to... Wow, that would have been nice to know at the beginning of this. Ghost. Don't let her see you. Oh. Ghost. Um. Surely no one's wandering about in here at this hour. We're gonna get spotted. You'd be wise to get out of here. It's not safe for young mortals. Yeah, I knew that, seeing that she wasn't fucking moving, but the other one was. Oh, where is that? Oh. I'll be quieter than a job and all. Ghost, don't let her see you. Go check the book out. How? I'm sure. Okay, so. Why is it the one ghost didn't fucking go then? Silent as a grave. Yeah, yeah, fuck you. Ghost, don't let her see you. Sure, 
You'd be wise to get out of here. It's not safe for young mortals. Really? I didn't even see that one fucking move. Okay, so I think I know what I gotta do. God damn, it's just fucking annoying. Ghost, don't let her see you. Should be in the clip. No need for us to be skulking about. So what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, Anne, so that she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone else has given up. Why do you think we'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help Anne? No. We've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mongo's. But I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Let's focus on what you're after. Which is what, precisely? I'll know it when I see it. You're being awfully cryptic. Huh. 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 Well, at least they didn't hear the chest move. Revelio. Wow, I love that whole session of not being able to move. Him or at least gets the librarian with a good excuse for all of this. Uh. Wait, I don't want you getting into trouble for me. I have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters. Besides, I like having friends who are in my debt. Now go. Good luck in your search. Thanks. Now, where has that damned poltergeist got to? I know just the spell to repair this armor. And sadly, I oh no, nope, not sadly. Jesus Christ, I hit the wrong fucking button. All right, here, start. Lumos. Wrong button. Repair. Oh, I think. Oh, that's neat. Doesn't look like I can change the appearance, but other than just the handle. 
So I gotta admit, I like that one. Oh. Lumos. Definitely probably shouldn't be down here. Of course. Traces of ancient magic. There must be more to this room. That's it. Huh. Just get new gear. What's it look like? So they don't look half bad. But again, the legendary gloves are nice. The dark hearts are nice, but these ones. That was my favorite looking art. Uh, Where might this lead? I don't know if that's a good idea. Off the edge. Hmm. Ah, I need to wake up that rune over there. Uh, question is, how do you do that? Incendio. I wonder Hold if I can hit the room with a spell. Oh, I just had to do that. I had to use a normal spell. Rebellion. Not surprising. Guards at the ready. Sense of spell. Oh. Your gift of each man accumulates by successfully attacking or taking damage. Successfully. 10 time hit combo will begin generating ancient magic. Hearts collecting these will generally fill your ancient magic meter. Small amount of health. When at least one segment of your ancient magic 
is full, you can cast Devastating Magical Agent. Cast Deal of Tapping L2 and R2. Thank you. All stuff that would have been handy. Right there. That's how you were. Interesting. Oh. Oh crap. Revelio. Oh no. What is that? Incendio. I have to do something. Rebellion. Nope. I'm not sure what I gotta do here. Oh. That worked. This must be the way forward, but to where? Dude, do you think I fucking know? Revelio.
Oh. So I think... Like foot. Revelio. Wait, what happens if I hit this? Ah. Love is like go down. Okay, so there's the one that stays in the middle. about me that's an understatement ah I have glasses again now I can actually check that gear part out let's equip those ah ah So there's a mask for it. Level 9. Which apparently drops my offense for some reason. Weird. Oh. Oh. Well. I'm glad they deal damage to themselves too. Oh, so I gotta be like really close up for that one. It is a book after all. Revelio. Okay. So is my teacher gonna like find me? Like, is Finny gonna find me down here? Hello. Goodbye. I like how I didn't even wait. No water.
Huh. I think this is where they're making Hogwarts. Or Hogsmeade. Learn to create, loss of learning how to destroy. That was the point of that. Oh, it's a little, you oh, here. wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald. Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach. Welcome. I'm guessing that was the Professor young Rookwood. girl. Professor Bacar. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad. Especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I've never heard of another like us. Miss Morganach. When we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere that day. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but... Oh, so it is a little girl. To me. It was not your imagination. Percival, Professor Rackham can see them too. But we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient oh. magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But... Let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morganach. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. A magic this powerful can do great harm in the wrong hands. It must be wielded by a select few. Uh -huh. As such, we ask that you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. That was not ominous at all. Oh, and I just... Sebastian. I'm gonna get in here, hit. Sneaking in the restricted section again! I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly, detentions are insufficient. I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. If someone has coerced you, I would have you tell me. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. There was nobody else. I came alone. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? Really? I didn't have like the option to like walk out? Oh, and I'm still in the library, really? Rebellion. After that, the Ornan Fountain featured in Tencent Scribe statues are tensions of the magic world, including a set of stone sirens encircling the fountain's face. <laughs> oh, I see me.
almost 5 30 in the morning. Come on, open up, you piece of shit. Being quest. Tomes and tribulations. You cannot be serious. Goblins working with rookwood makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox. It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. Hmm. Uh -huh. Sir, I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. Yeah, he's what? probably... That's... Wait. Wait. You accessed the restricted section? But how? Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the details. Fair enough. In fact, the book was below the restricted section as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. Wait, the book disappeared. Oh, oh dear. Some of these pages seem to be missing. It How? appears someone Wait. has got to the book before us. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful, though it may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive. Two. Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival oh, yeah, Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? They were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic too. Why those memories? Hmm. Hmm. Perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. Huh. What will you tell them about Mr. Osric's death? I don't know how much I dare say. George tried to convince the ministry about Ranrock, but to no avail. My instinct is to follow the path we are on for the moment and keep the details to ourselves until we know more. Yeah. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spell casting. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. Hmm. I'm glad to reward the menu. Sweet. Level 9. I have a it's time letter. Prove your dueling metal and see if we've a new school champion. Meet me at the usual place for the final round of crossed ones. Also, the training dummy is still available. Sweet. Meet me in Lower Hogsfield as soon as possible. I would like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow, and it might be best to do so outside of the castle. Now just sent you an owl plus requiring you to meet her in the lower. Hello, okay. That's the world map. This is the world map. Most of the map is covered by fog, eliminating what you can see. Hamlet to small communities through the woods. 
Very cool. Research Hamlet, lower uh, hogs field. Hamlets provide new opportunities for vendors, food flame, and side quests and collectibles. As you explore, you will remove the fog and reveal more of the map, unveiling new opportunities like Hamlets, dungeons, bandit camps, and many other locations. Professor Fig and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. Okay. Alright, well, I think I'm going to save. I'm going to Save, I mean. Bloody hell. Here we go. Save. And. End this fun live stream here. Didn't. Well, the game is amazing. Sadly, the live stream didn't start off as what I was hoping for, seeing that I was originally streaming on YouTube. I wanted to stream it on YouTube, but then YouTube fucked up on me, so I had to move to Twitch for the live stream so thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed the live stream uh well i hope you enjoyed the live stream and if you want hit the subscribe button uh because i do upload i will upload these straight to youtube and same with if you want to follow me on twitch so you can keep an eye on when these go live and when i'm live so you can chit chat with me about whatever and yeah uh till then i will see everybody in the next live stream